Welcome back, everybody. Little Fish here with another blind bag review. And today I have two Disney's Lilo and Stitch figure key rings released by Monogram Entertainment. So, without much further ado, let's get started. And of course, we will begin by taking a closer look at the packaging. So, at the top, Disney's Lilo and Stitch figure key ring, pages above four. The background is green, and not sure if you guys can see the floral pattern in the background. And it features nine of the 11 different key rings that you could collect. So there's a sleepy stitch, and I think a surfing stitch, but we will take a closer look at their names on the back of the packaging. So these are artist renderings. And there's a warning, these are not intended for the ages under three due to small parts that could be considered choking hazards. And this only contains one figural key ring. There are no tear strips in the bag. Flipping it over to the other side, Disney's Lilo and Stitch, figural key ring, and that is the QR code for Monogram's website. Collect them all. And all the different versions are Alien Stitch, Lilo, Hula Stitch, Hawaiian Stitch, Stitch in Sunglasses, Bikini Hat Stitch, Stitch in Pajamas, Stitch in Uniform, Stitch in Shorts, Exclusive A and Exclusive B. Again, the packaging is a greenish color with a Hawaiian print in the background. Produced by Monogram Internationals, and you can visit them at monogramdirect.com. Also produced by Disney. It says product color and specifications may vary from photos. Please retain the packaging for reference as it contains important information. There's a lot of stuff that says that, but I still don't understand what could be so important about the packaging. Nonetheless, here we have our bag, and now that we've taken a look at it, let's open it up and see which of these 11 figural key rings we've got. Alright, and from bag number one, each of these does come in a little cardboard container so you can't really feel out who you're getting or what you're getting, but we have, I think this was Hawaiian Stitch? Let's see. It is Stitch in Shorts. So our first figural key ring is Stitch in shorts. So a floral pattern on his red shorts. And he's giving me thumbs up. This key ring feels very dry, kind of chalky, but it is made out of, huh, I thought it was made out of kind of a rubbery material, but it feels a lot harder than that. More like a plastic feel. Um, I think they're actually supposed to be foam. This one seems a lot more stiff than usual. Nonetheless, from the back. Kind of surprised they don't have his tail sticking out the back. You can kind of see the bulge where it might be poking out, but nope. Oh, stitch from the bottom, from the top. And the key ring is made out of metal. It's nice and sturdy, but I wouldn't pull on it too much because you never know how sturdy the little rubber or foam or whatever these are made out of little holes there might be. See the scruff on the top of his head. So there we have our first figural key ring for Lilo and Stitch. Let's open the next bag. And next out of the packaging, we have this does have the cardboard, but you fill right out, and we have Stitch in sunglasses. Yep, Stitch in sunglasses, looking large and in charge. Also, this one feels kind of dry and chalky, and it also doesn't feel like the foam material, or doesn't feel like the other figural key rings I've gotten in the past. It feels a lot more stiff and sturdy. So that's pretty nice, actually. It's a little scruff on his front. Oh, yeah, it's on both of them. Let's take a look at them together in a moment. And his tail. From the bottom. And the top. And this one also has that sturdy metal key ring. So these are our two Stitch figural key rings. A little disappointed I didn't get Stitch in his spacesuit or alien Stitch, but I actually kind of like these. So in the comments below, let me know what you guys think. Of the two figural key rings I got today, which one do you like the most? Hate to say it, but I think Stitch in Shorts is my favorite of these two, but they're both pretty cool. Very vacation ready, and since it is summer break for most people, I hope you guys are all enjoying your summer if you've already gotten off from school. If not, I hope you enjoy it once you do. And if you like this review, make sure to hit that thumbs up, and if you haven't already, please do subscribe. And for further content, you can always follow me on Tumblr, Instagram, and Twitter. And until next time, everybody!